I mean, Red Kefla, you can still use her right now. She's not going to be good, but you can still, like, you know, do work with her if you know what you're doing with the character. Um, uh, this character really never had a time to be used, though, right? I mean, she released... We already had the red Super Goja to Zenkai. It had already been out for, like, six months by the time this Kefla came out, and she did not even come close to being as good as that red uh, Goji to Zenkai. Nowadays, you use a red unit like this Kefla in, in the meta, guess what? She's getting one carded <laughs> by all these blue units running around. You think Sword of Hope Trunks is going to have a good time fighting this Kefla? He's going to kill her in like one hit. <laughs> Same thing with Ultra Gogeta, right? Same thing with Bardock, honestly. Like the Zenkai Bardock from like two years ago is going to kill this Kefla in one hit almost. Um, but I mean... Uh, a lot of what she's trying to do is based on her attacking first, which I actually think is a good concept. They just didn't execute it correctly with this character because she's getting... Let's take a look at what she's getting here. So I think it's under here. Yeah, applies the falling effects to self every time own attack is evaded with a vanishing step. So she gets 20 key, 20% 20 damage, 60% vanishing gauge recovery. Um, and then she, what, she draws a card. That is not anywhere close to good enough. And this is an entire unique ability. This is an entire unique ability that is dependent on you fulfilling a condition. So pretty much, there is actually a chance that... Actually, not even just a chance. There's like a more likely than not probability, I would say, that this entire unique ability does nothing when she switched into the battlefield. Like, this, this, this actually has a really high chance of doing nothing. It's as if this is not even here. Um, this needed to be like twice as good as it is for it to be worth it. I think 60% Vanishing Gauge is like barely not good enough. There's a reason, by the way. There's a reason that they gave this Kefla, or sorry, there's a reason why they gave uh, the Goku and the Vegeta 70% Vanishing Gauge recovery on their blue card. This, this, the difference between 60 and 70% is so massive. And it's the same thing we see with Purple Hits Blue Card as well. Purple Hits Blue Card restores 60% Vanishing Gauge. The difference between Purple Hits Blue Card and Goku and Vegeta's Blue Card is night and day. That 10% difference between 60 and 70% actually does make a huge difference. So, the fact that this Kefla only gets 60% Vanishing Gauge recovery, I don't want to say it might as well not even be there at all, but you're very, very unlikely to see that actually matter, I would say. Um, 20 key and 20% damage. I mean, that should be 40 key and 50% damage. Then you should be drawing two cards. Like, this needs to be so much better um, to reward you for being proactive and actually attacking first in, in this game, right? That's just how this works. Um, the one good thing I think she does do, though, is she does actually gain the, like, LF Broly, LF Majin Vegeta mechanic of ignoring... Special cover changes with her uh, main ability pop for 15 timer counts. That actually is pretty good. Um, but her green card is pretty bad. Her ultimate doesn't really hit that hard. And overall, I'd say that she's just not an impressive unit at all. Um, her, all of her teams that she's on, she's just not... Like, honestly, she's not even the first or second option, I don't think, on any of her teams. Except for maybe Fusion Warriors, because Fusion Warriors might only have two reds. Like this Kefla and then the Zenkai Super uh, Gogeta, because you're not going to use the red Vegito at all. But... <laughs> Don't think so! <laughs> Here goes! <laughs> Have a nice trip! I'm pumped and ready to pound some head! <laughs> Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Too slow! 
your power! Guess it's my turn. Yeah. Going in. Take this. Two. Here I go. Feels good to be a Saiyan. 